Yeah, out you come there, newly, like a good girl, and she's over there to the far side. I'd be able to walk away in here. You're all right, pet dog, get up a shawl now, stay where you are. We'll have a quick look. I just want you to tuck your two knees good and tight together there, Martin. That's it. Put your two hands on top of your knees. Now, this is only going to take a second, lovey. We'll be in. <coughs> we'll be. <laughs> We'll be in and out, you won't even know that we were there at all, Pish. Okay, no, two seconds now, you won't even know that we were there at all, lovey. I just want you to roll over now, just roll over slightly. That's far enough for getting in at your area, all right? And, and you didn't, did they give you a slice of toast this morning or anything, Martin? You didn't, did you? Are you sitting there long, lovey? You are. You're there long enough, God love you. Wouldn't you give us a bus earlier? You found your teeth? You did, isn't that great? <laughs> we won't have to mash it up later. I'm going to leave that with you now, Nooley. You can leave that under and there keep an eye on it. OK. And what I'll do is get Dr. Dobbin to look in on you straight away now. He'll be doing his rounds. OK, Martin. I'll just throw that over you there. Take the hands out from underneath. <laughs> That's it. Do you know what, Sister Bridget, getting the wrong idea. Keep an eye on him now, Nooley. Don't let him wander off, won't you, like a good girl? He's gone very bad, Helen, isn't he? He's gone very shook. I'd say you didn't even recognise him above, did you, Pet? I'd say you didn't even recognise him, the poor old devil. He's gone very down, gone downhill very fast. He's only wishes a fortnight, you know. That's all, he's gone downhill very fast. He came in here with a fine head of hair and him, you'd hardly recognise him above in the bed, the poor old devil, God love him. He was above, he was above in the house. He was up above in the house one Sunday, and the, 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 wasn't there an office bit of shit in the room? What do you got? That's a thing. And Maura turned around to me and says, e Eugene, uh, did you have an accident? She says, I said, no, I didn't have it. I got fairly indignant about it, you know. But I was after changing the tablets, you see, and I wasn't sure, you know what I mean? So I got caught out the week earlier in the post office. So I went into the toilet to check, and I, I was fine. There was a blank canvas. I was all right. So I came out, I said it to, I said it to Maura. I said, Maura, you, I said, you, and you looked over, who, who's in the colony of uh, Adler Eastlip? She says, go over and have a watch them. I said, I want, at this stage, the two windows in the room room open, it was like a jumbo jet going through the place, you know what I mean? So I had to go down to him and say something to him, you know? <laughs> so I went down to him, I said, I said, I went up to him, I said, fair, because he wouldn't be great, he wouldn't be, he wouldn't be great at hearing, you know what I mean? I said, fair, fair, I said, <laughs> I said, uh, do, 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 I said, do, do, uh, I, I, you, uh, I said, I, you know what he's like. Uh, I, I said, fair, fair. I said, I, I, are you all right? I, I, I'll have a glass of white. So he said, and he, and he, uh, I said, I said, no, fella, that's not what it. I said, I said, did you, did you, did you sign yourself? Oh, we should all. Spilers, it was more often. He said, I'll, I'll have a glass of brandy. So he said, after I come back from this island, and I could see him walking out, and he drank it on his boot behind him. He was after, he was after what? Look here, he was after walking into it. I'm coming in the door, so I wait. More than my wife, then she kind of instigated the poopers, poopers around that area. And in fairness, I think anyone that have a dog should pick it up and tidy up. Her. And even people, Johnny, that don't have a dog, it's their civic duty to pick it. Should I pick that up on the way in? <laughs> yeah, definitely. I pick that up. I just want to get a quick shot here. Is that I'm all sorry, right? I, won't hold you. I said I won't hold you up two minutes. What the guy? How are you, Jerry? How are you? Sorry. I can walk for a second. What are you I'm doing? just getting a quick shot from the local paper. What paper? The big chip crowd here. The, 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 the veiled champion there. Uh, there's a big chip crowd here. I won't hold you up two minutes. Okay, two minutes. Because he talked the ass off you, wouldn't he? Huh? Huh? I must prefer, I must prefer the other fellow. <laughs> come here, come here. Yeah, keep, get a quick photo of the two idiots left for the paper, you wouldn't mind. This is <laughs> coming out next Saturday now, Jerry. I see you on that. Now you keep it. Great to see you. Yes, you're, yes, you're looking well. You're all, you're all done up for the old, the, the old last night of the late late, are you? Huh? Yes, you do. You look, you look well now. You're turning out well. There's no doubt about it. Come here, was Jason Quigley down there at all? He's up at the first hand. Come back to you one minute, Jerry. Now, are you driving the bus tonight back down? You are? I, yeah, yeah, you are. I, got, I want a quick word with Jason. He's over here at the first hand. Well, Polly, now are you giving? Oh. Yes, I didn't recognise you. Nula, how are you getting? Jeez, you've the hair all done up. I didn't recognise you. <laughs> isn't it lovely? You're all styled. There's a big crowd here, isn't there, from home? There is a big, and you've had a lovely job done to here. You can see the roots and everything. It's <laughs> lovely. It's a nice, old, tidy job. Where's Jason? There's Jason here. Now, come here. You're doing food above in the clubhouse. Yeah, someone was telling me there. 
Fair play, and you're in the county final next week. Fair play. Could you ever say to the boys, and I won't hold you up too long because I want to get down and have a hold of Jack, just to say to the lads they're doing food in the clubhouse there, and I was in there last Friday, and all that was on the menu was fish and cheese. I can't stand fish at all. I wouldn't, I wouldn't take it really. And there was a club sandwich, and I'm not a member of the club. So I was kind of caught out with that one as well. So just tell him put on a bit of salad or something like that. All right, listen, best to look at the county final. I'll judge you later on. He's after getting a tidy here, but the same fair. You know that I come back in a while. I should fuck him. Yes. Jesus, Jerry. Young Quigley, do you know him at all? Yeah, he's in the county final there next. It's just, uh, Sunday after Christmas, is it, Jason? Yeah. The under 14s, yeah, he's a five. <laughs> oh, he's a big lad now, there's no doubt about it. He's shaving since he was two and a half, his mother told me. That's what's going on. And Jason, look at the outfit on you. I'm just after seeing it newly there. Show me, look at the style. Jesus, I had a lovely. Jesus, that's after reminding me. I had a cartina one time with a set of cast seat bubbles like that. That's the truth of God. Here, I'll bet a whoop and set a whoop and have a chat. Listen, Jerry, I'll see you later on. I'll talk to you in a while. Come back to the meeting. <laughs> Big one below. <laughs> Down the side aisle. That's right. Yeah. Oh, that, that's Petty Wench's daughter. That's the eldest girl. That's Philomena Wunsch. Oh, my Jesus, I didn't. I'm telling you, that's Philomena Wunsch. That's Petty Wench's daughter. That's the eldest girl. So she's too big to one of Petty's. Jesus, happened to all them Wunsch's the same, haven't they? Bigger sitting than they are standing. <laughs> Long back and shock legs. That's pretty well too, Arthur. That's Philomena Watch. Yes, I tell you, I know them all. That's not one of them. I'm telling you, that's Philomena no, Watch. No, sir, haven't you? Bernie, Bridges, Brady, Booty, and Brenda. That's right. And there's Vera, Veronica, Vanessa, and Valerie. That's right. Then you have Mina, Mina, and Mona. That's right, sir. The three twins. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> You're Mara, Mara. That's right, Mara. And then you're Mary. There's Mary. Yeah. And there's one of them very young. There's one of them very young. Jesus, what's this? There's one of them. There's one of them very young. There's one of them very young. There's one of them. 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 Down there. Jesus, you're right. Now. Now. And I hold on fish. Now. I have a place now. She's out for isn't she? Oh, that's right, yeah. She's above a litre. That's right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's making a right over, I believe. Oh, Jesus, yeah. I tell you, yeah. I tell you, <laughs> he did a lot of damage for a small man, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What did the small jockey have the big quick fight? Oh, <laughs> What time are you hoping to be up at? Oh, well, I said 50 dinner on for half twelve. So we're having soup, then we're having roast spuds, bile spuds, ancient spuds, old spuds, no spuds, mashed spuds. <laughs> we're having roast beef, jelly and ice cream, sweet cake. No tea, no wash up. Straight out the door. <laughs> I'd say we'll be at the match at about five to. Lovely. <laughs> Yourselves? Our we said we'd have a clear run of the day, so we did dinner this morning at half eight. <laughs> Tell me, 
Who's picking up young Walsh? That fellow want to be collected now, mate. Well, I don't know. I got right man for the job there, you're an idiot. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Mickey, don't have anything to do with it. Oh, Jesus, Mickey, John. Oh, Mickey, yeah. Mickey, Mickey, Mickey won't take any nonsense. Mickey, it's hard to him out. Mickey, it's hard. Do you think they'll win? Oh, my God, I hope they'll win. I have a five pound note on top of him. <laughs> Lord bless the heroes! <laughs> You get sorted out all right during the week, you did? Oh, I did, yeah, I did, I did. I got the train to Dublin. Lovely. Got off the train and then I got straight on the bus. Yeah. And then I got another bus at the bridge. You had no problem finding a place off of that bus? Oh, no, O'Neill's up at the top of the city. They sell all the stuff, bags, balls, holidays, jerseys, the whole fitting lot. I got two bags of new jerseys, came back down on the bus, then got the other bus up to the station. Jesus, the train down was lovely. Go ahead. What a smashing. Jesus, we stopped in Newbridge, Kildare, Port Arlington, Port Leash, Paddy, Brophy, Temple, More Tullus, the Big Junction, Change it, the Big Junction, Flynn, Big Donald, the Child, and the Mallet, Change it, Mallet, Fox, and Lee. Then straight into Cork. Yes. <laughs> Is that your young fella below? I don't decide, eh? That's right, yeah. I'm forgot it is, yeah. Huh? To be more his mind now to be poking a ball around the field and to be stuck in the middle of the women's aisle. <laughs> <laughs> well, to sort that one out fairly lively, huh? Very good. Or he'll end up like his uncle Walter, a fucking hairdresser. Huh? <laughs> It's no in, you might as well go back down and enjoy yourselves. But we are in town, Pike. That's, yes, right. that's right, sister. That's right. No is no, right? Hello, 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 settle down. Hey, come over here, come over here. Where are you going with the bay? John Kenny and Pat Short. Huh? John Kenny and Pat Short. Make up your mind who you are now, you're either one or you. <laughs> John Kenny. Oh, where are you going with the bay? I'm going just back to the changing rooms. What are you changing? I'm not sure. John Kenny and Pat Short, the unbelievable. We're doing a show here tonight. 
John Kenny and Pat John. Jeez, you're not doing any show here tonight. <laughs> Well, we haven't booked any shows. You're not booked for rent in here tonight, no, I can tell you that now. You're not booked for rent. No, but... Were you talking to Feather B. Lee? Who? Feather B. Lee. Paddy Leary. Chairman of the Hawk Commission. Well, I'm, well, I'm only after writing. And how did you get here? Are you serious? Straightforward enough question now. Straightforward answer to the fire. How did you get here? Well, well I drove. Now, where'd you pack the car? Just, just outside the front door. Just outside, there was a gap outside the front door. Well, yeah. there was, well, there was a space. space I just pulled in there without asking. Yeah, come, well, over, come over here, you. Come over here. One minute. <laughs> now, me, I'll tell you what you can do with yourself now, fairly lively. Take, take that hand down now, fairly lively. Take that hand down. Take that hand down. Tear me down now, fairly lively. Number one. You can go back there to the tea stall there, Piggy. Lines is down to the tea stall there. She's down to the Buckle Bailer. She's having an emergency meeting with Paddy Leary, chairman of the Hall Commission, as to where this crowd will have to come and out of, right? Well, there's a possibility. Number there's two. A number there's two. There's a possibility. Number two. Paddy will tell you what you're doing, when you're doing it, where you're doing it, what time you're doing it at. Right, okay. That's if you're doing anything at all. Oh, right. Take the hands down now, fairly lively. Take the hands down now, fairly lively. Calm it down. Number three. You can go out and move that fucking calf from outside the house. Because there's a, the, there's a chip van going in there in about five minutes. If that's not shifted, I'll have it shifted for you fairly lively. Do you hear me? So you can go back there and have a quick chat with Paddy. He'll sort you out now fairly lively. Do you hear me? Hello, Mr. Larkin. Well, what do you want? Come on, Jerry. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. How much are they? Which are they? These here? Yeah. They're three of them for a penny. Will I get you three of them? No. How much are they? Which are they now? Yeah. These here? Yeah. They're a penny each. And how much are they? Which are they now? The pops? No, no. Or these here? Yeah. They're, they're a penny each as well. And how much are they? The teeth? Yeah. You can get two teeth for a penny. How much are two of them and two of them? Two of these, is it? No, two of them. Two of them? Yeah. Two of them. That's ten pence for two of them, right? Yeah. And you can get two of them for a penny. So that's eleven pence for two of them and for two of them. And how much are they behind? They're a penny each behind. They're a penny, right? Yeah. They're a penny. Okay. Look, they're a penny. They're a pe They're three for a penny. They're a penny. They're two for a penny. And the pops. The pops are five pence. Them pops are five pence there. They're five pence. How much you got, Jenny? How much have you got? Show me, look. You have uh, you have twenty and you have two, and that's a penny, right? That's a penny. So that's twenty-two and one is twenty-three. You have twenty-three pence there. And what you do? Just three of them for a penny. You can get three of them for a penny. What Jesus will you make your mind up? Uh, uh, how much are they? There what? What are you paying to this? There, them ones there. Them, them, them there? Yeah. Is that what you... Them there? Yeah. There's two of, you get two of them for a penny. Uh, for, two of them for ten pence. Yeah. They're ten pence each. Uh, and can I get two of them and two of them? Two of them and two of them. No, they're ten pence each and they're five pence each. And uh, can I get two of them and two of them? You can, yeah. You can get two of them and you can get three of them. Yeah. You can, yeah. And, and them? Yeah, you can get two of them and you can get three of them as well. You can get six of them. And them? No, no, you can't get them. They're a penny each. How much about those? No, you... Yeah, yeah, all right. You can have them. Yeah, yeah. Two of them and two of them. Or two of them. Can I get two of them and two of them? What them? What two of them now? Two, two of these or two of the pops? Two, no, no, no. One, one of them and two of them. No, you can't get one, yeah. one of them and two of them. But you can get two of them and you can get one of them. And you can get three of them. How much have I? Now for fuck's sake, Johnny, come on, what do you want? Give me, give me, give me two right, of them. Come on, come on, here, I'm, here, I'm come on. one of them. Come on, now, look, here, look, there's two of them, I'm, right? I'm, I'm one of, one of right. them. What do you want? Yeah, you, get, yeah. you get the three of them, right? Yeah. Okay, now, now, there you go. Now, there, show me the money. Come on, now, come on, out. Come on, out. Can I change one of them? Get out, come on, out of it. Come on, for fuck's sake, come on, just tell me a way in a home is coming on. Not on my feet, you're a hat pick and broke. How much is this? How much is this? I'll tell you a small bit of work done here today. What do you think? Open up the eyes, ears, the whole lot, lads. Sit up straight. Because, well, look what men mind. You're back with us again, you are, huh? 
Go back in the fish of your heads again, eh? Because you got a bad old knockout last week, didn't you, eh? You got a bad old dose, all right, yeah? Huh? You were out for the full week, I believe, is that right, yeah? Yeah, God, you're looking to come out for with your life, aren't you, Ryan, eh? <laughs> you got a bad old dose, all right, yeah? Still all the same, you weren't too bad to play the match in the rain on Wednesday evening, were you, eh? <laughs> I hope you have a note with you for your own sake. I want the one with you. All right, let's knock it down. Before we start up here today, there's a few things I want to draw to your attention. We seem to have an artist in our midst, sir. Huh? We seem to have a right funny man down there with the buyer. Because when I was leaving this school yesterday evening, this is what greeted me on the notice board. Now, lads, you can take a good long look over this for yourselves now. You can take a good long look at that now. Because I can assure you one thing. Because the last time you'll ever see the likes of this in this school again, if I ever so much as see like that in the wards again to be held to papers, you can pass that message out to anyone who isn't in today. There's the two buckers, yeah. There's the two right Larrys below, yeah. But my taking buckers, all right, my two prize pupils, huh? <laughs> Wayne, well, pass that back to the two boys below. Pass that back to them. Pass that back along to the two. Come back with that. Come back, come back, come, come back with that. Come back with that. Give that back up to Ryan. Give that back up to Ryan. Now, Ryan, who did I ask to pass them back? Did I ask half the class? I asked you, isn't that right? So lift yourself up out of that seat fairly lively. Come up here, me. Look. Look here, you. Look. Give them to me there. Give them to me there, Ryan. Now, Tommy. Take a stay where you are. Stay where you are. <laughs> now, Tommy, take a good long look over that for yourself now, Tommy. Now, Willie, have a good long look at that now, Willie. Now, Ryan, in future when I tell you to hop, you hop or I'll hop off you. Do you hear me? Sit down there and give your time short. Sure. Okay, Tommy, take a good long look over that for yourself now, Tommy. Take a good long look over that there in front of you, Tommy. <laughs> now, Tommy, tell me what's on that there in front of you, Tommy. I can't hear you, Tommy. I can't hear you. What's on it? <laughs> There's nothing on it. Good man, Tommy. Very observant of you, Tommy. <laughs> now, Willie, what's on the one in front of you, Willie? I can't hear you, Willie. I can't hear you. What's on it? <laughs> nothing. Good man, Willie. <laughs> because you're well matched the two of you, all right, aren't you? Eh? Two right funny books below, all right. Eh? Can you tell me, Tommy or Willie, what's supposed to be on it? I tell you, boys, now there was supposed to be a two-page essay handed in to me yesterday evening, isn't that right? And that's all I got after two of you. Well, I tell you what you two boys can do with yourself there fairly lively. Get your bag, your baggage, the whole shebang, lift yourself up out of there fairly lively. Bring the whole lot with you here, Tom. Come on, open out, down there in front of me, the two of you. Get down there in front of me. Down there in front of me. Ryan and Hayes, up to the back, the two of you. Come on, up, 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 up and out. Up, up and out. Bring your bag and baggage with you. Bring your bag and baggage with you. Up you go. Now, boys, sit yourselves down there, the two of you. Now, I want you under my nose for the rest of the year, do you hear me? And when I come back in here tomorrow and the day after, if I ever so much as catch you up the back again, I'll hop off the two of you, do you hear me? And have that finished, boys, I can guarantee they'll be trouble. Okay, lads, knuckle down now. Settle down now, because the holidays are over as far as I'm concerned, do you hear me? I'm going to knuckle down here and try and get a small bit of work done here today. Take your hand out from your garbage, I'll talk you. <laughs> As I'll tell you this much, lads, I'm coming in here day in, day out. I'm looking down there into the crowd here, and I'll be looking into a field of tissues. <laughs> and I'll tell you this much, I get as much of a reaction out of them. And lads, I would know who you think you're trying to cut me, because I can tell you this much, you're not cutting anyone on yourselves at the end of the day. I'll be here with another bunch next year. I'll be here with another... No. <laughs> Lift up your boat. Lift up your boat. Lift up. I want to see underneath it. Lift it up. Lift out your boat. Lift it out. Lift it out. Lift it out. Lift up your boat. Lift out your boat. There's a summon after dragon shit in all the place. I'm blue in the face, I'm telling you, when you're coming in the school gates, when you watch where you're walking. Get up there like good men open the window, let a bit of fresh air in around the face of the wire. You're just walking into it and you're just dragging it in there behind you. Well, you must be the most ignorant bunch I've seen in this school. And I tell you, I've seen a fair share of them down throughout the years. And you just saunter in there with it and drag it in there behind you. As if there's no one to clean up after you. Well, I tell you, I, th 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 there's something good. <laughs> come up here. Come up. Come up. 
Fuck, look near you. Fuck. Lift yourself up here fairly lively. What did I just ask you to do to her? Open the window. Open the window. Yeah. What are you doing sitting down there? Okay, I'll open it. Stay where you are, stay where you are. <laughs> How many years have you stayed back now and you still don't know where the windows are? Do with yourself now, do I have? Is that your coat? Yeah. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Put it on you. Put it on you. Now, I'll tell you what you can do with yourself now, do I have? When you get out there and you find the front door, don't stop till you find the front gate and don't bother coming back here to get me the manners, do you hear me? Straight out. And take the smirk off your face, Mooney, or I come down there and I'll personally take it off for you. Do you hear me? As you're sitting back there, the crowdy, you're happy out, the big sneery heads on you, not a bother in the world here. And you think you're going to saunter through the year. Well, I'll tell you this much, you've another fucking thing coming, you. Half of you don't know how you're even going to finish. Of course, Maloney's different, isn't that right, Maloney, eh? I got you something else, all right, Maloney. I got you a good one, all right, haven't you, eh? I believe you're going out to America, Maloney, is that right? Answer me when I'm talking to you, Maloney. <laughs> is that right? That's right, yeah. You can't even find the school gates and you're going out to America, eh? <laughs> well, I'm delighted the rest of you find it so amusing. <laughs> because I'll tell you this much, if there's one man down there that has no stuff to do, it, it's Maloney. Isn't that right, Maloney? And while the rest of you are sitting back there, happy out with the big sneery heads on you, the one man here that has no stuff to do, it, and will go out and do it, is Maloney. Isn't that right, Maloney? That's right. And I tell you why. Because he's thick enough. Isn't that right, Maloney? <laughs> you ask Maloney to go holy was up in his Australia. <laughs> and he turned around and filled it in for you. And asked the rest of you to it, and you've uh, smacked elegance forever. You wouldn't lift a finger to help yourselves. So I tell you this much, Maloney, don't mind the rest of them. Go down there and do it for yourself. Because you've the stuff to do. And don't be stuck here in Glengoolie in about 20 years' time with the rest of them sitting in our storm wards and puts the fags gathering around their ankles and our fat and jackets on and wonder why they're getting chill blends. <laughs> Go out there and do it. But whatever who do Maloney, do not end up like Darcy. Darcy! <laughs> You're the right funny man, Darcy, aren't you? Huh? You're the right funny man, Darcy. But you didn't think I spotted you, though, did you? <laughs> Take your hand down from your guard, Darcy, when I'm down. I give you one warning now, Darcy. Take it out, whatever you have, and take it out fairly lively. <laughs> I give you one more warning now, Darcy, and a small bit of advice to go with you. Take it out, whatever you have, take it out fairly lively, and don't make me come down to you. You're only drawing it on yourself, Darcy. You're only picking your on yourself. What have you got? What have you got? Put it, put it, put it on, put it on. What should we hear that? What should we hear that? Got the right funny man, Darcy. And you'd sit down there, the big happy head in you, and you'd suck away like it was sucky care from the corner, Darcy. Wouldn't you, Darcy, huh? Theresa, what's the rule in eating sweets in this class, Theresa? No sweets. Good girl, Theresa, now. Did you hear that, Darcy? Of course, there's one rule for Darcy, there's one rule for everyone else. Isn't that right, Darcy, huh? But I'll tell you now, Darcy, I'll have these in safekeeping for you, and you'll get these back at the end of the year in good time. <laughs> but you'll come in here, Darcy, and you'll sit back, you'll sit... <laughs> Jesus, Darcy, you're trying to poison me now. Is that what you're at? Come on, come here in front of you. Come over here, you. Come over here. I'm going to get the one thing to sort you out now and sort you out fairly lively. Come over here, you. Stand there, Darcy. Stand there. I'll get the one thing you understand and sort you out for once and for all.